Here's how we create text shine effects on Illustrator. So let's start with the base text. Uh, we're using this one as an example. It's the same. It's the first one you saw. Let's add in the background by duplicating this. Let's press Ctrl C, Ctrl F, and let's change it to brown and add in a stroke about 10 points. Then let's go to object and expand and go to your pathfinder and press unite. Now we have this. Let's go back to our text. Then let's color this white. Then let's duplicate this again. Ctrl C, Ctrl F and add in a gray stroke or any, any color that you like. Next is to add in the weight. Let's have this a three or four. Okay, let's just have this three. Then go to object then expand again. Once done, uh, let's press Pathfinder then merge. Double click on the white, select same, fill color, then select again and inverse. It's gonna select anything that was not white and delete. So we now have the inside text here for the base text and we can color it with a gradient same here it's up to you what what type of color do you want to use the next i'm gonna use the knife tool here then create a wave so uh this is a trial and error so you can just use Control z and try again until it looks perfect to you then next uh, let's select the lower part and have the gradient Go towards the top same with the top parts okay then let's select the base text again and add in base color let's use the darker orange for this so it's already coming together the next step is to add in the highlights so you can do that by selecting this one's on top press ctrl c then let's press ctrl f to duplicate it in the same place and let's try to use the lighter orange this time and have it even lighter then ctrl c and ctrl f again duplicate it go down one step let's change this to white and select the ones we made the highlights for and then press uh, merge okay so let's select all white same fill color and we're left with the highlights then for the finishing touch so it will uh, pop out on dark color backgrounds we can add in the stroke at the back let's try to use the base orange and add in rounded brush at around 0.5 then let's just click expand And there you have it, uh, text shine effect using Illustrator.